done. Friday evening, and I had a vision, a vision of tying a fly, not just any fly, a fly that would catch trout. As I tie this, you ask yourself questions. How will this bugger dance in the water? How will this bugger change my life? What is a bugger? These are all questions you ask yourself when you're tying the perfect fly. Last month, we kind of took a little bit of time to get back to me on what the deal was. And so the guy was like, yeah, we're just going to... What about to the left here? Pardon? What about to that pool right to the left yeah. there? Man, these things are tiny. I know. Does yours still have car marks? Nope. Mine does, I think. Unless it's not a book chart. What are you? We're on the board. Horrible, but you are. How small? Look at how small yours that is! That thing! <laughs> that is a beast! Look how pretty he is. You're right. Look at that. Gorgeous. Cool. What is this? I caught myself. Oh, that thing is mo- it's, it looks like a huge tick. Really? That seems like a terrifying idea. Let's see. That's a dragonfly really? of some type, yeah. That's gonna be a sweet dragonfly guy. The river's alive. The river is bumping this morning.
So we were paddling and a school of brook trout swam by. So now we're just gonna chase them up river a bit. Oh, there we go. Got him? Oh, oh, oh. first cast. Dry fly? Yeah. Big, biggest one so far for me. We're getting bigger. All right, bud. Thank you. You're so pretty. There he goes. Yeah, that sounds. How does that sound? I think it could be anywhere from six inches and up. Oh my goodness, he is beautiful. I picked up a caddis before and it was like kind of mottled. Oh yeah. No, I'm using a caddis fly. Why? Yeah. Uh, because as we've been drifting down, I've seen caddis fly and there's larva all over the place, so. So would you say it's a classic match in the hatch situation right now? Yeah, <laughs> yeah. <laughs> That's a better way to uh, describe what I was trying to say. <laughs> Classic matching the hat. And jump. Oh. But she's pretty. Get your caddis on, Noah. Come on. Come here. Hey, little bugger. Who's going to film you guys then? There's like three right here. You see them? Surfing Noah? Yep. I don't know Noah. I might need to capture one of these caddis and ex examine it a little more. Because they're jumping all over the place. And not for my caddis. I just looked up. Look at how many caddis there are. I know. Here. I'm the caddis king. <laughs> so I was trying hard to catch a fish with the woolly bugger, but the conditions say caddis. There's a huge caddis hatch here, and the other guys are catching them all on caddis, so I'd be foolish not to change. So I switched over to an elk hair caddis, size 18. Let's see if we can get one. So as a group, we've caught 11 or 12 little brookies so far. A couple bigger ones for the system, like, I don't know, I think Shane lost a 10 inch here, which is pretty decent for here. But the farther we go down, uh, the closer we'll get to the ocean and the better chance I think we have of catching some sea runs. Well, I did not get that on film, but I am finally on the board with this nice little brook trout, caught in an eddy. Pull another one out of here. It's, it's the skidding motion. That's they like the skitter? Off. Noah's rod tip up motion has just been getting him hot and bothered. Like this last one, I was just doing this. Yeah. Well, somebody just came up and smoked it. So what I've heard is with mayflies, you want to kind of like dead drift it because that's they kind of hit the surface and, and chill. Yeah, where is But it? caddis, they kind of like they, they bump, skid. bump a lot. Over, yeah. I like this. I like this technique. Come on, somebody, come and munch it. Come on, come from the deck. Oh, tell me you saw that shit. <laughs> is he on? I don't know. <laughs> yeah, here you go. <laughs> yeah, the hungry little guy. <laughs> The sk <laughs> Come on, skitter or caddis! Skitter, skitter work. <laughs> Look at it. Oh! Oh! You missed it. Did you see that? Yep. Come on.
<laughs> Come on! They're getting smaller. <laughs> going backwards. Oh, oh, you missed it. There you go. Um, I might, this might be the smallest. Double header. <laughs> yeah, I'm thinking this is brown. Oh, I think you might be right. Relax. Get in here. Yeah. 100%. Look at that. Yeah, and look at his his fins that don't have the leading white edge. No, yeah, right? exactly. Whereas this one has the. And white like, look edge. at like even just the top of them too. Like this guy's more spotted than. Kurt Brown. What a what a lunker too. <laughs> right. <laughs> okay, what do we got here? We got some chaga, off a nice birch tree. Would you peel the uh, like the white stuff off of it? Is that just the bark? Yeah. So. I started by doing that, but I got lazy and I just started grinding up everything. <laughs> <laughs> you're some you're still here to, this is my biggest catch of the day. If you didn't know what that was, you'd be like, people who were watching be like, what the hell is this thing? Well, if you guys don't know what Chegg is, go back to an earlier video. It does not look like a mushroom, but it's the king of mushrooms because of its qualities for, as an antioxidant, anti-inflammatory, overall superfood. Make it in coffee, half coffee, half chaga tea. There we go. Yeah, there we go. That was like picture perfect. Oh, that's we got that on film, man. Ah, oh. <laughs> man. All you needed to do was bring him in. It would have been I the know. shot. Man. National Geographic quality. <laughs> Get one job, Sean. Oh, I took it away from him. <laughs> Idiot. You run brook? It's a brook. Uh, I don't know. Look at those spots on it. Come on, that's a decent fish. Nice. No. Perfect. That's, this guy's super tiny. <laughs> that's it! Look at the size of this thing! <laughs> What are you? Oh my god! What? What is it? That is a... Ah! It's a chub of some type. Multi-species day. Look at the, um... The barbules on its nose. And its bright colored fins. Spawning! The creek chub are spawning! Big spawning fish! Alright. So we're just finishing up for the day. Full action packed day. As a team, we caught 34 trout. We're not gonna talk about size, 
Uh, some of them were like two inches. I think the biggest was possibly 10 inches, but still we found a pattern that worked really well. Learned a couple new techniques on the water and uh, the bugs weren't even that bad. It's coming around in the last couple bends here to finish the shuttle. I think it's the sketchiest is the word. Sketchy, yeah. Tomato. Well, it's not sketchy. Tomato. Potato. It's not too bad. <laughs>